Hi everyone. Today I want to do a big numbers ranking. So this ranking is gonna include some of the uh, most famous big numbers, especially um, the ones that we have talked about so far. So I'm gonna rank them from the smallest all the way to the biggest. So let's get started. So now let's start with the smallest number on this list, which is 10 to the power of 80, which is the number of fundamental particles in our observable universe. And this number is 1 followed by 80 zeros, which is quite big already. And next, we have a Google, which is 10 to the 100. Next, we have 2 to the power of 77,232,917 minus 1, which is the largest known prime number as of April 2018. So this number has around 22 million digits. So obviously it's bigger than the Google, but it's smaller than the next one, which is a Googleplex, which has a Google amount of zeros. And next we have <clears throat> the first skewest number, which is 10 to the 10 to the 10 to the 34. Next, we have 10 to the 10 to the 10 to the 100, which is Google Plexplex, or somebody called it Google Duplex or Google Plexian. Next, we have 10 to the 10 to the 10 to the 10 to the 2.08 which is the Poincaré recurrence time for our observable universe. Next, we have 10 to the 10 to the 10 to the 964, which is the second skewest number. Next, we have 10 to the 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 1.1, which is the Poincaré recurrence time for a super inflationary universe. And this is also the um, biggest number in physics actually is also the biggest number outside of mathematics so next we have mega which is between 10 two arrows 257 and 10 two arrows 258 so there's a big jump between the this one Poincaré recurrence time and the mega and this is way bigger than this one and next we have three triple arrow three um, which is uh, I call it or we call it Sun Tower which is uh, one of the number one of the big number appear uh, related to Graham's number um, next we have the Magistin which is between 10 triple arrow 11 and 10 triple arrow 12. Then next, we have G1 from Graham's number. So this is the first step to construct Graham's number, which is three, four arrows, three. Then next, we have the Mosa, which is between two with mega minus two up arrows, three, and two with mega minus two up arrows, four. Then we have G2, which is 3, with G1 number of up arrows, 3. Next, we have the little gram, which is between G7 and G8 of gram's number. Next, we have gram's number, which is G64. So it is 3 with G63 up arrows, 3. Next, we have A stands for Ackerman. So we have Ackerman G64, G64, which is also known as the uh, XKCD number. So <clears throat> this number is way bigger than Graham's number. But the funny part is that it's actually smaller than G65 of the Graham's function. Then we have 3, 3, 
which is way, way, way bigger than anything we mentioned so far. Next, we have SCG-13, again, which is much bigger than Tree 3 Then we have Loader's Number, again, <laughs> much bigger than SCG-13. So numbers after like G65, this is a big gap between those numbers. We don't even know how big is the gap. Then we have BB, which stands for the Busy Beaver function. Um, we don't know how big this number has to be, this N has to be, to be bigger than Lotus number, but we know that this number doesn't have to be very big. Most likely smaller than a thousand. So Busy Beaver function is one of the most famous uncomputable function, which grows faster than any computable function. Therefore, eventually, this function, this whatever n we put in here, eventually it will be, it will grow faster than anything from here and below, because even though this number is a computable function. And next, which is the last one, number one is Rayo's number. It is bigger than any number before it. So there we have it. This is my big numbers ranking. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.